Oh, there we go. Look at that. Oh, don't want to get wet. Don't wash away. No, no, no. Get back here. Whew, that was close. All right, may have gotten a little wet, but. Good morning, Bonnie. Here's an egg cockle. Looking for a sand dollar. There's gotta be one out here. And let me turn the light off. The sun is fixing a pop. I wanted to show you, look at this spot we came upon. You know how much I love finding squash lines. So we have them up high. We have them down the middle. And we have some goodies right along the water's edge. There's got to be a sand dollar in here. All right, let me pop the light again. So let's walk along the water first. All right, we got to catch the colors. We catch the colors and then we'll go up the middle. There's a quarter, there's a quarter, there's another piece, there's another piece. Alright, there's got to be a whole one around here. What's that? Oh, there we go. There we go. See, I could see from down there. Sand dollar make you howl. Look at that. Right, let me pop the, or I'm going to set the light down. Let me grab that sand dollar. There we go. All right, it's our first one. There's gotta be another one in here. There's a piece. All right, so we moved up to the, the higher swash lines. I think there's one, here we go. There's a piece. All right, let's turn it and go a little higher. There's a piece. All right, let's try it out the light. Here's one. Pretty awesome finding sand dollars in the swash lines. There's some color, there's a cockle shell. Just gotta keep zigzag, oh, there's one. So yes, zigzag back and forth. There's one over here. And here's the one I just, I spied with my little eye. There's one. Check right here before we move. Oh, okay. Here we go. That other one up higher is not gonna run away. So we'll get that one right now. It was right over here. Normally I don't move like that because they do get lost. Your eyes readjust and then you can't find it again. Oh, here's one. Now this is the, the up highest this one. Let's keep looking around. So finding sand dollars can be relatively easy once you know where and when, and I'll even throw in the why. When you put all those together and the stars are all aligned, you should be finding some sand dollars. something quick. 
quick. Now you see the, the swash lines here? I want to show you a different one. While you can find sand dollars here, let me show you the one I prefer. Looks like a little piece of aluminum or something. So this is that spot earlier, right when we got here. What's sand out there? When we chased the, the bonnet off into the surf, I was like, it's rolling away. Here's a 50 cent piece. Look at all the broken ones here. Right there, right there. This is a gorgeous spot to come upon. This is a cool jackknife. All right, I don't see any sand dollars. Oh, and here's one. Oh, look at that. Look at that eye. That would have been cool. Look at the pieces here. There's one. There's one. Now, if you recall, the other swash lines were faint. You know, just basically sand. Now again, you can find sand otters there, but I prefer to look in areas like this. Oh wow, look at this coquina. Oh, I had to stop, I thought I saw a sand dollar higher up. That is a gorgeous coquina. All right, let me show you some similar swash lines over here. I see a sand dollar right here. Well, there's an egg cockle higher up. But these are the lines I prefer. Well, here's a piece of one. Let's check out this egg cockle. And whether you're walking mid beach or you're down along the water's edge, the same thing goes. Keep walking until you find some shell debris, some vegetation, some twigs. Then you slow down and start looking for shells and sand dollars. All right, here we are higher up. We have color, a little bit more debris. And look at way over here. There's a sand dollar. Look at, ain't she pretty? Nice and white. some birds up ahead and I see some debris along the water's edge. Let's go check it out. When you're walking along, always look up ahead. This is the kind of spot you're looking for. Grab that zip tie. Harem is already here checking things out. Little band. Looks like we might be getting into a good stretch here. Swash lines are getting a little heavier. Oh, when you're finding them right along the water's edge, you better grab them. They'll wash away. Oh, there's a tiny one up ahead. There's one. Look at this little one. Oh, two of them. Look at this. Oh, that one's tiny. Look at this one. Look at that one. And then, this one's a little bit bigger. Oh. Pretty cool. Oh, here's one. And these are just washing up. This a little sun ray. Sun ray and some sand dollars. Alright, I'm looking up ahead. You can see it gets nice and heavy right there. I don't see one. 
But if we turn, look at this one, Mid Beach. This one right here. Let's check higher up. All right, here's one higher up. I see a lot of people who walk past that one. Just slightly dusted. Go up every once in a while, see if there are any dolphins. Higher up, some good color, some good debris. Then here we go. And using our zigzag pattern, look at here, down by the water, just washed up. Don't forget to check the pockets. Here we go. Right over here. I'm gonna look to the right a little bit. Some squash lines over there. All right, where to go? There it is. Here's one. Okay, I'm standing up on a, a little ledge, if you will. I don't see anything down here, but I noticed behind me in this flat, there's some swash lines. Some swash lines up the middle here. And some shell crumbs up here. There we go. Look at that one. Y'all see it? The sun's kind of hitting it. Look at the shell crumbs. Looks like there's a good spot up ahead. Look at this. First speckled talon. My first thought was, oh, sand dollar up ahead. No, that wasn't my first thought. My first thought was Swedish fish. I could really go for one right now. Another speckled talon. And up here, I don't think anyone would find that one. They'd probably get stepped on when the crowds come out. We'll grab that one. Okay, here, here's another one up high. That one's right on top. Check the footy prints. Oh, there's a, looks like a sun ray. Oh, really fragile. So sometimes you'll find, you know, not only sand dollars, but other shells right in the, the footy prints. The waves come up and drop them right in the, the little hole. Pelicans hanging out. The bigger pieces here. Let's see what this one is. Look at here. Just said we're gonna pause here and admire the color. Look at that. 